If you don't have at least five of these coins I'm going to give you today, I can almost guarantee you're going to be missing out. Because if you want to milk 2024 and as we go into 2025, I believe strongly that these coins will It'll change your life. Now, by the end of this video, I can promise you two things. You're going to get what I'm buying, what I've currently bought, but the most important part, my deep dive plan with these assets that you will guarantee you will make money and life after 2025, well, it'll be as easy as taking candy from a baby. Sorry, babies. Now, one of the main kickers here is that it's going to be a bumpy ride. The ship will not sail smooth the whole ride and there will be many storms along the way. And the truth is, well, you know this. This is crypto. It's never as easy as you think. So you must be able to stay in the game when things get tough. All of the people that were buying late in 2022 and 2023 and stuck with it, they're now seeing the fruits of their labor. And it wasn't smooth sailing for them either. They had to huddle down on their positions when shit got hard but now they're printing, so you must stay in the game. Because if you don't follow this, you might make these mistakes. June 2023, I made a video about render at $2. I thought I was late as I was looking at it at 50 cents, but we've now seen this run past $12, so you must have conviction and go. Now we need to talk about the elephant in the room here and why if you hasn't bought already. The second best time to start loading up is, well, it's right now. And that's because of this, the four year cycle. But here's the problem for most people. Most people mess this up so badly and this is what happens. The harsh reality is 90% of people lose money in crypto. But here's the good bit for us. It's very, very easy to be in the top 10% that make all of the money because, well, honestly, those 90%, I hate to say it, they're honestly brain dead. And that was being the last run. Oh, it's going up forever because Michael Saylor said BTC is going to hit 250k and then I'll take profits. Such an idiot. Now, getting into these coins, well, I'll start with the safer ones and then we'll go down the list of the more risky, but obviously giving you more returns. Now, Solana, a complete blue chip. Play this to destroy BTC and smash ETH for gains. I was bashing on about Solana in December 2022 at $12 when everybody was saying it was dead. I still seen the value here and I thought it was a good buy. Now, being up more than a 15X when we were buying, well, kind of sucks right now if you're just coming into it. But what I can say is Solana is here to stay, at least for this bull run. The problem is, well, is what you'll be getting in terms of returns with a market cap of seven to eight billion dollars. Well, I think you've still got at least five to seven X compared to BTC and Ethereum. You have a tiny bit more risk, but you'll make more gains. So, so that's the trade-off. But as we dive further in this video, I'll give you some sneaky tactics to find more juicy gains with Solana but not using Solana directly. Trust me, you're going to want to stick around for that because this tactic that I will share you later on, it's going to explode your bag by 2025. It's going to be like gardening, planting those seeds, nurturing them with care and patience, and eventually it blooms in a massive plant that will give you those, well, life-changing gains. Now, why will Solana still do well? Look at this TVL. Now, TVL simply means total value lock. This is a metric used in crypt to determine the total dollar value of digital assets locked or staked. What's happening, boys? Well, <laughs> It's growing massively. So people are actively locking up and staking Solana, which has given it this massive run it's had in the last year or so. And if we look at the volume, we can see the massive spikes that correlates with the time frame of the TVL, giving Solana more reason to surge here. And what's funny is you can see when we click on Sol's price compared to these two other metrics, don't you think it's funny how this always exactly correlates with these two? Not to mention the team here behind Solana Labs gives me confidence that these guys can keep growing and developing the product. Now hold on there, don't get too excited about Solana because there's one main problem with this coin and it's, well, this. The gains have well and truly left the station and if you're a small investor or someone with even 10k looking to get in and your goal is, well, hitting that magical six figure mark, from the Solana is, well, you just won't make it. But don't worry because I got you. Further down this list of coins, we'll dice into more juicier cryptos to give you those 10x to 50x returns that you probably want. And this will get you all that 95 jobs that you probably hate. So you can come into work in 2025 and you can say to your boss, it's been fun making you rich. Guess what, sunshine? I made it. And you just leave, you walk out the door and he or she is left there thinking, well, what the hell happened? You're a new man by this point, or lady. I know there's probably 10 females maybe watching this video, maybe five. But I want you to understand something first. And this will get you pumped. We haven't fully hit the bill run yet. We're not even close. Now you will know where we're in the bull run when your feed, when your Instagram feed or your Facebook feed or Twitter or whatever you guys are using is full of crypto stuff. And even normal people who aren't normally talking crypto start talking about it and what they've bought. And that's going to cause even more people to FOMO. Remember, crypto is here to stay and it's a very small market compared to the stock market or Forex. The US stock market is currently around 50 trillion and crypto is only 2.5 trillion, which is about the size of Apple right now. To put that in perspective, this is also the US stock market. Crypto, well, it's international. 
excited yet. Now, next up, we have Rune. Again, we've missed out some other great plays that, that we're still playing, like Chainlink, AVAC, and those are great, and they still should be looked at. But Rune, Rune is a different beast. From the lows of sub $1 last year in July, breaking $10 or so before having a little cool off, Rune is a behemoth of games yet to still come, and here's the reason. Now, we go back to the TVL on this, and we can consider around October is where this really started to go in terms of TVL. Now, next we look at price, and don't you think it's funny just how in Solana's case, Rune starts to go at pretty much the exact same time as TVL grows. Then we look at volume and oh my, what a coincidence. And Rune is a great product. We can see a lot of people using Rune and more people will come in at this point and this will cause phase two of another Rune search. Now these guys do native asset settlements between Bitcoin, Ethereum, BNB's chain, Avalanche, Cosmo and Dogecoin, Bitcoin Cash and even Litecoin. Now, Litecoin is like that too, it's end of the bar that, that you really don't want to go home with, but all your other options, well, they've dried up. Or is that just be? Anyways, looking at the exact stats here, what can you see? Growth, and it keeps growing. Super bullish for Rune Token going forward. ICP, now what's crazy about ICP is I first overlooked this, mainly because of the chart. I don't think I've ever seen a worse chart in my life when I went to check this out. And this was because it was heavily manipulated on launch and had really no chance. However, this is actually now a benefit because if you're buying now, you zoom into the last year and you see a different story. And this becomes a massive opportunity because this coin doesn't even have to go back to its all-time highs. Raise the gains. Because when you look at the circling supply here, there is not much inflation here. Where, where everybody dumped in 2022 and the big players manipulated this. Because what ICP are doing and their behemoth of an A-player team, these are obviously more risky plays. But, but if this goes well, this coin is going to print. But before we get into some other projects I'm looking at this year, I want you to remember this chart, bro. This is where you can really get crazy with gains. And I want you to understand it. So to pause this video now if you want to read it more. But essentially, this is where we can play the four phases of money flow. Duration of the phases are parabolic, meaning the first phase takes the longest and the last goes the fastest. Phase overlap can happen in a temporary reverse. Or if we're in phase one and transitioning back and forth between phase one and two, prepare accordingly. Think of this as if Ethereum runs and then Solana, ADA, BNB, etc. start to run and then Solana, ADA, BNB start to go. You can use this to rotate these profits to smaller caps until we get into the fun part, phase four. If you can play this alongside with your main bags, you can really profit and you might notice some of your exit strategies you smash way before you even think. I'll show you in a practical way, here you have eight altcoins here on the left. Now one of them starts to pump, you can either sell and take profits and bank BTC, or you can buy another unpumped strong altcoin to add back to your bags, plus banking the initial profits from the original coin. This again is really how with yes more risk, you can multiply returns. Again, Pause the video here if you want to digest it more. It really will change your life if it's done correctly. Now, I want to get into some gaming coins here. Along with AI, these have been the best picks so far, and we're not even getting started yet. Some coins have definitely flew, but there is many opportunities left on the table to still clean up. IMX, Beam, and IOV, for example, three fantastic, safer plays to get your feet wet in the gaming space. Stuff that isn't going to go away tomorrow, but bet we can feel safe and trust. Think of it like this. You pull up at your grandmother's house, and you know one thing is going to happen as soon as you get in the door. She'll first yell at you and tell you that your posture shit to straight up, right? And how you've got to start getting a real job. But behind all of that, you know a lovely big meal is coming no matter what. This is what top coins in each sector is like. With these two gaming coins, you know no matter what, they will give you that return. You'll be, you'll be fed in these projects, and you, you won't make the most, but you'll be satisfied. Gala, Axie Infinity, both solid projects in the last run with gains, and they're tugging along nicely, but, but I know with Gala, they're still developing massively with their games, and they've had struggles with founders suing each other and all this nonsense with the merge of the V1 token that scared a lot of holders off. Now, AI, one of the most talked about categories in the crypto space. These are where you can get those 100x returns, and these really run wild. Render, Fetch, Ajax will be your safest ones, but as you scroll down, you get to discover the real sauce. And the thing about AI picks is most of them have nothing to do with AI. The smaller market caps will be run by retail and leverage traders simply gambling, so if you can get ahead of the curve here and be ready to dump on retail by 2025, near the peak and maybe rotate some profits down the line, you can be sure to have massive success in the AI space. Phew. We got a ton of value there, boys. Now, now, all these are great plays and there will be many other coins to go on, but there's still one problem we haven't solved yet. We need to dive deeper into a strategy so you can guarantee returns on these picks. So that's why you need to watch this video here where I'm going to be breaking down exactly how to snipe these coins in an easy way, plus roll over these gains to make even more profit.